We're here at the AFCO Collegiate Open at Dardanelle. First big tournament of the year. I'm, I'm excited. The first stop of the season on the Bass Pro Shops Collegiate Bass Fishing Series is the AFCO Collegiate Bass Open. This two-day traditional five bass limit format event takes place on Lake Dardanelle in Russellville, Arkansas. Lake Dardanelle is a 34,000 acre reservoir. Uh, it's a, it's really fishes more like a river system. It's got the Arkansas River going right through it. It was just uh, voted a top 15 fishery in the central region area of the United States. One of the premier fisheries in the region, Lake Dardanelle is a healthy body of water that offers a phenomenal playing field for the top collegiate anglers to compete on year after year. The Association of Collegiate Anglers is proud to partner with the Russellville Tourism and Visitor Center to host this prestigious event. The fall of 2020 will mark the fifth consecutive year that the Open has been contested here. Oh, let's get the net. Big one. On an annual basis, anglers anticipate the start of the season and the opportunity to compete on Lake Dardanelle. With the event now being fished in the fall, one of the main factors anglers search for to find success are shad. Yeah, you know, we're really focusing on, on a, lot of, a lot of shad. You know, I think the bass are really focused around bait this time of year, so we're trying to find that all, anywhere we can. You know, it seems like shad patterns, um, so white, you know, and throwing like uh, sexy shad, all white, that kind of seems like what we're getting the best bites on. Lake Dardanelle is filled with shoreline vegetation, rocky banks, and flooded timber for bait fish and bass to hide out in. Anglers often find success on a wide array of baits in a variety of different areas across the lake, which makes for an exciting two days of competition. Boom, baby! Yeah, baby! Yeah, let's go! Got one. Yep. That's what I'm talking about, girl. Let's go. Along with the tens of thousands of dollars worth in prizes and contingencies available at this tournament, the race for Bass Pro Shop School of the Year, presented by Abu Garcia, looms large in the backs of these anglers' minds. We're sitting in seventh right now. We really, really need to do good in this tournament to move on up. 1,000 points are awarded to the winner of the AFTCO Collegiate Bass Open. And with this being an ACA round event, schools can earn points for their highest two fishing teams inside of the top 100. The stakes are high, and these anglers know it. I mean, our attitude towards this tournament is the same as any other tournament. We're, you know, we're, we're here to put as many boats as high as we can. Um, and you know, that's, that's why we're leading school here right now. Uh, it means a whole lot because our coach has actually been looking to get our, our team into the top 10 for past couple of years now to finally do it and be in position to, to make that top 10 cut is, is pretty cool. Along with the Russellville Tourism and Visitor Center, this event would not be possible without the help of its title sponsor, AFTCO, the American Fishing Tackle Company, a world-class outfitter known for making some of the best clothing and accessories on the market today. AFTCO is working on leaving a lasting impression on younger generations through extensive conservation efforts. At AFCO, conservation is really important for the brand. It's something we've been doing since 1973 in saltwater. It's something that's part of our heritage. It's something once we've gotten to freshwater, we want to make sure we made an impact to the resource. The ACA is proud to partner with AFCO by promoting the Bank Bag program, as well as through fish care initiatives tied to the Bass Bus live release boat. At each tournament, these young anglers are exposed to the positive impact conservation initiatives can have on a fishery for years to come. Well, number one, it keeps our lakes, you know, so we don't get trash in there while we're fishing. We don't see trash everywhere, get them dirty. And uh, so throwing it in the boat, throwing it in all that, and uh, letting it fly everywhere, we just decided, you know, we were going to do this so that we can get a uh, gift card to AFCO. That just shows them giving us a bag to fill up with trash shows how much that they're caring. They're losing money by having us clean up other people's mess, and that really says something about a company. $14.97. $14.97, $15.68. That's got you in third place, guys. Awesome. After two days of competition on a fishery as good as Lake Dardanelle, the difference between winning and finishing in second place can be just a matter of ounces. And whether it's your first event as college freshman or a milestone victory for anglers in their respective school, a win at the AFTCO Collegiate Bass Open is a feat to be proud of. It's incredible, um, especially for a consensus to be first, but 
since we just started our team, it's big for our team and our school, so it's, it's a great thing. We're ecstatic, honestly. We come in second last year in this tournament, we were coming back for revenge. Somehow we managed to make it happen and fish our freaking tails off at the last minute. 